Maxwell statement of faith. I want to be baptized because I want the spirit of Jesus to be in me. As um, they called my name up to go over to the pulpit, my heart started beating and they asked all the family members and friends to stand up. Well, almost the entire crowd stood up and I heard tons of clapping and I just felt really excited. Well, when I came up, I felt like a brand new person. Hello, my name is Maxwell Johnson. I am nine years old and I go to St. Stephen Church. Maxwell was born at St. Stephen, and from day one, St. Stephen has loved Maxwell, and I love the fact that they take ownership of him, um, and we appreciate that from the ministers to uh, Miss Dixon, who's part of the, uh, the staff that takes care of the church, uh, to Minister Geneva, our Sunday School Superintendent. Well, I like how you can go over to the Family Life Center and grab yourself a little bag of Doritos. <laughs> Seeing Maxwell, so involved. It's a little Stefan walking around St. Stephen. Everyone knows him. Hello Maxwell, how you doing? I mean, he just, he has the run of the place. It is so very important for St. Stephen to be around because St. Stephen is the foundation. Well, when I am older, of course I will because I will want my children to get the exact same that I got when I was a child. I can't help but to think about, you know, those 14 people um, who 80 years ago planted a seed and, and built a foundation. And, and that's the foundation that we're standing on today. So my dad asked my mom, why is Women's Day before Men's Day? And so when my mom went to um, do the welcome, she knew the correct answer, but she said, well, how else are they gonna know what to do in September? <laughs> yeah, we didn't like that, did we, buddy? Next week is our Women's Day weekend celebration. It all kicks off Saturday morning at 9.30 a.m. in Multipurpose Room 1 when our First Lady, Sister Barnetta Cosby, will lead a special Sunday School class for all volunteers. This class has been put together to help meet our Sunday School attendance goals. So if you're volunteering in any capacity for Women's Day, whether usher, greeter, or singing in the choir, then this class is just for you. We want to pack the place next weekend. That means every member attending a Sunday School class. And then at 11 11 a.m. It's our Women's Day Worship Saturday service with special musical guests foretold from Lexington, Kentucky. Our special guest speaker for Saturday will be Dr. Cynthia Campbell, pastor of Highland Presbyterian Church. Our Women's Day celebration will culminate on next Sunday with music provided by the Soulful Singing Sisters of St. Stephen. Our special guest speaker for all services will be Reverend Raquel Gill from Brooklyn, New York. Please don't forget our Women's Day financial goal of $200,000. We're encouraging everyone to make a special gift offering of $150 on Women's Day as we lead the way from debt to destiny. Hi, St. Stevens. It's Josie Evans sending you love and greetings from Huntsville, Alabama. I'm excited about Women's Day, and I've made my pledge, and I encourage you to do the same. I'll be watching on live stream. Love and miss you all. God bless. From debt to destiny.